Hello, my name is Sachin Lohar. Today I am going to uh, teach you operators in C programming language. There are multiple operators in C programming languages. Today we are going to cover or in this video we are going to cover the arithmetic operators. There are different different kinds of operator like arithmetic operator, bitwise operator, relational operator. So, but in this lecture, in this lecture we are going to cover only arithmetic operator. Okay. Normally these operators are useful to perform the mathematical or logical functions in C programming language. So in the arithmetic operator, major operator is called as the first one is a plus operator. Okay. This operator is also called as a unary operator. Okay. Why it is called as a unary operator? Because plus operator you can use with a single operand. Okay. So if you want to write down the plus 2, you can write. Okay. You can write down the plus a. That's why it is called as a unary operator. I am repeating again. The unary operator means the operator which can be used with a single operand. That is called as a unary operator. Okay. This plus is also useful for the doing the addition of any two numbers. We will take an example if the a is equal to 10 and b is equal to 30. Okay. Now I want to do the operation a a plus b so answer will be the 40 so this is the use of plus operator next operator in arithmetic operation is a minus okay so this minus operator is also called as a unary minus operator why it is called as a unary minus again because you can use this minus operator with a single operand so in this example if we write down a minus b is equal to minus 20 right so these are the plus and minus these also called as a unary plus or unary minus operator okay next is a multiplication multiplication is not a unary operator because for multiplication we must need more than one operands okay so we, if we write down example a into b so the value will be 300 right so just the multiplication of any two numbers next operator is called as a division operator so if a divide b okay so as we know if a is value is 30 divided by b 10 3 is a 30 so remain, remaining is a 0 so whenever we are going to do the division okay whenever we are going to do the division at that time we have to take this part this will be the so that is a 3 will be the answer so that is called as a division operator again this is not a unary operator this is a operator with Minimum two operands are required for performing operation. Next is a modulus operator or percentage. Okay, so if we will do a mod b, the answer will be zero because again in division, if you are dividing thirty by ten, the remainder will be zero. So this part will comes when you are using the modulus operator. When you are using division, this part will be the your answer. Okay. So these are the basic arithmetic operator. There are two more arithmetic operator. It's called as a first plus plus operator or increment operator. So if I write down plus plus a, so the value of the a is 10, right? The value of the a is now presently 10. When we are using the a plus plus a, it will become a 11, right? Because it is incremented by one. It is, it is nothing but the meaning of this plus plus a plus plus a is nothing but the a plus 1 right so this is called as the increment operator there is another last but not least operator is called as a minus minus operator it is also called as a decrement operator minus minus a okay so now the present value of a is 11 and if you are using the minus minus then it will become again 10. 
right? Or if we say that the value of we write down here minus minus b, so my b value is a 30, and when we are saying minus minus b, it will become a 29. Okay, so these are the arithmetic operators in C programming language. There are different different operators are there in C language, which we are going to discuss in further videos. I'll I'll remind I'll review one more time. In arithmetic operator, the first operator is called as a plus unary plus operator, which is useful for addition. Then second is a minus operator, which is called as a unary minus operator, which is useful for uh, subtraction. Then multiplication, which is not a unary operator. Then division for division purpose, you can see the difference between division and modulus operator. Modulus will give you the remainder, and division will give you the quotient. Okay, and then plus plus increment operator and minus minus is the decrement operator okay so this is about the arithmetic operators in c programming language thank you